For this week's Microbit Challenge, you are going to be making a motion-based synthesizer. Uh, for this to work, you have to make sure you've got a speaker connected to your Microbit, um, as I've got in front of me right now. So you're going to need to create a circuit using two crocodile clips on your Microbit. One goes on pin zero, which is the white one on the left, and the other one goes on the GND, which means ground, right on the right. And then on the other side, where your speaker is, you'll have a little headphones connector, and you need to make sure you've connected the white tip, oh sorry, in my case it's a white wire, but the one that connects to pin zero will connect to the very tip of your jack plug, and the cable that connects to your GND connector on your micro bit will connect to the bottom of your jack plug. Once that's all connected up, we should have a synthesizer that can work like this. So I've got my battery pack connected so I can pick it up and move it around, and I've got my A button program which is going to be my mute, and my B button which is going to make the sound start. So here we go, it's a bit loud. So that's it, a motion-based synthesizer. Uh, you can experiment with the code a little bit to see if you can change the frequency of sounds that are being made, um, but, but that is what you have to make this week.